Okay, so um, for some reason I didn't do commentary when I recorded this, so I'll just do that now, I guess, because every other one since Dragon Quest, all the other spirit events in Smash since since the Dragon Quest Hero DLC, I recorded with commentary. So I will just I will just add that. It's in the future. I recorded this in January, end of January. It's mid August now. Of 2020, both. So yeah, Kunio Kun. Yeah, here, here's there's Kunio Kun. Here I am, changing out my spirits. So yeah, I think I played I played one of those one of those games on the NES on on the Switch on on the NES Switch games. That's the one where you're like running around outside beating people up and they say barf. I don't know if they actually barf or and, and they just like can't they can't convey that either because of the NES's limited capabilities or because of ESRB standards. Was the ESRB a thing yet when the NES came out? I don't know. Maybe it had actual barf in the NES version and then they toned it down for the for the Switch release. I'm not sure. So Anyway, yeah, here I am picking the spirits. I've picked the spirits. I, I wasn't even paying attention. Okay, so let's go to the spirit board. Let's go to the spirit board. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Spirit board. So we got Goda. Goda. Is that a type of cheese? Battering types. Defeat the main fighter to win. The enemy side special has increased power. The enemy favors side specials. Okay, so he's gonna whack ya. Okay. What is Donkey Kong's side special? I don't remember. Hmm. He's gonna whack ya in the back, apparently, based on all those. Well, no, it, it only it only recommended it once. Okay. Use up some of these, some of these snacks. Yeah. So, so I could use again. Ready? Okay. Go! Oh, he's got he's he's got the oh that he's got that thing. Ooh. That that roof is miraculously unda oh! undamaged for being have, having having somebody buried in it. Two can play at this game. Diddy Kong. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, I got the cheese boy. So, got that. The fun thing is, this was, I think this was the first, the first, um, one of these I did after OBS added the pause recording button. So there's no big wait times, because I think I just, I just hit pause. Right? Right? 
I was I was checking over these apparently. Just thinking, oh maybe there's one hiding that I haven't actually finished the battle for. But no, I don't think that exists actually. Yep, there we go. I I paused over it. And here is Ryuichi and Ryuji. Represented by Ryu. And I'm guessing another Ryu. I did not look at the, the rules. Whoops. Hmm. Okay. Enemy side special increased power enemy fiber side special, so basically same as the last one. Uh, it is two Ryu. Two of them. Oh, that must is that must be his side special. I no, I'm I'm actually not even familiar right now with Ryu's moveset. It's a sword. I've always wanted a sword. Hey, 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 Ryu! Can I hit you with this sword? Thank you. See. Were you so nice? Can I hit you with this sword? Oh. Can I can I hit you with the sword? Hmm. Well, he never he never really gave me an answer, but I I did it anyway. I hope it was okay. Whoops. Okay. I got Ryuichi and Yuji. My computer's being a little loud. I hope it's not picking up. Doesn't seem to be. Anyway, here comes Riki from River City as opposed to Riki from Xenoblade. What if they switched places? Can you imagine? Instead of having a support character on your party in Xenoblade, you just have, you just have a short 8-bit guy beating people up. I probably would have beaten Xenoblade at this point if, if he was on my team. Ready, go! And on the other hand, the NES, in trying to render Riki's 3D model, literally explodes. So I don't think that would work. Victory! Happy, happy time. So yeah, I got Riki. That was, that was very quick. I was like so focused on, on the, the, the joke that I was making that I did not even pay much attention to the fight. I think there was just one more left. Oh, but I'm backing out for some reason. To check the shop, probably. And I'm like, oh yeah, that's something I can do. This is not the shop. Never mind. I'm checking to see how much more there, there potentially is. I'm like, okay, well, there's at least one more. And now I'm like, well, I should look at the thing to see... see. No, I didn't look. I'm just going here to, to, to hit pause, I guess. Okay, cheese boy again. Guess I'll have to pause again. Okay, him again. Guess I'll have to pause again. Oh, and they're up there. Okay. And Kunio! Kunio Kun himself. He has finally arrived. Well, oh, item title wave, item battering types, enemy favors, neutral specials. Ugh. Ugh. I'll, I'll finish read it, reading it in a second. Enemy has increased attack power. Certain items will appear in large numbers after a little while. Okay. Well, you came to the wrong stage, buddy. This is this is my stage. 
I will beat you up. I'm... This is this is a trick. You see the, those numbers next to next to my name? Those, those are those are actually your numbers. Okay, let's stop messing around here. Actually, fight him. Some of that. And um, oh oh oh, you've you oh no, I decided to throw that away. Keeping it playing playing it safe. I, I like it. Good good thinking past me. Honestly, I'm probably more cautious than I should be, in general. So, maybe I shouldn't be praising that. I don't know. Oh! Oh no. I am Tidal Wave. Oh, it's time to eat some delicious jelly donuts! Oh, it's so good! I especially love the seaweed that they wrap around the rice. That's how you make a jelly donut. You take you take some rice and you wrap a little bit of seaweed around it. And, oh yeah, you got you got to like shape the rice into a triangle. That's how you make a jelly donut. Any any self-respecting baker will tell you that is that is the the steps to creating the the most delicious and nutritious jelly-filled donut on the planet. I am dead. Ouch. Maybe if I ate more jelly donuts, I'd be fine. Okay, okay, okay. Cunio round Tunio. Let's do it. Let's let's get something a little more, a little more, more strong. Hmm. Filtering it. Oh, okay. Okay, Kunia. You had your fun the first time, but I am taking you down now. Oh. Oh. Okay, 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 Kuni. Hey. Hey. Get off my tower. Oh no, that's a that's a gold gold hammer. No, no, no. Put that down. Put that down. Put that down. Thank you. Though honestly at that point I would have preferred if you if you carried it to your death. But you know. You did actually yeah, I did actually ask for you to put it down, so that's fair. Oh, oh, am I going to take the power this time? Nah. <laughs> oh, wait, no. No, it's the Rage Blaster. It's the Rage Blaster. There we go. Now. I got confused. It's the Rage Blaster that I was thinking of that's, like, good. The Scythe is the one you do not want to be on the playing field if you are anywhere near... A hundred percent. Because you can be killed. And that is like the only purpose of the scythe. Anyway, I think that was the last one. Wasn't it? Am I gonna am I gonna double check that right now? I'm looking over my collection. I'm looking over my collection. Also Yeah, the spirit list. Important note. Look at where the the numbers are on there. Keep, remember that for later, because the it things can change. It's foreshadowing because I'm recording this in the future. I'm I'm hinting at future events. Anyway, thanks for watching. Goodbye.